in a small cottage, far, far away from any civilization, there lived a pencil and an eraser with their owner, a author. Hey, eraser, isn't life just great here? Yup, life just can't get any better. Hey, look, the author's leaving. Let's go see where he's left us. All right, but don't go too close to the edge. Ah! The pencil fell off the shelf and landed on the floor with a loud thud. Hey, what's this? <laughs> it looks like a treat. I love treats. Ow! That hurt, you know! Blah! This tastes horrible. This tastes nothing like a treat. When Rufus the dog bit down on the pencil, everything suddenly went black for the pencil. Uh, uh, uh. Must be the eraser who pushed me onto the floor where the dog could get me. It must be you who pushed me off. Eraser! No, no, it wasn't me who pushed you. You fell off all by yourself. Of course I didn't fall off on my own. It's you who pushed me. I'm going to get you for this, eraser! The pencil tried to poke the eraser with the sharp tip, but missed and hit the dog instead. Ruff, ruff! Hey, watch it there! That hurt, you know! Pencil tried again to poke the eraser, but missed and hit the cat named Goofus instead. Meow! Ouch! My tail! <laughs> With a loud crash, the pencil's tip snapped right off. Uh. My tip, my poor, poor tip, I slapped it right off. Suddenly, with a loud snarl, the cat and the dog, Doofus and Rufus, appeared out of nowhere, and with a loud snarl, they cried, Ruff, ruff! Meow, meow! We're gonna get you for all the harm you've done to us. Both animals snarled loudly, then lunged for the pencil. <laughs> There was suddenly a bright flash of white light. <gasps> Thank goodness none of that really happened. The pencil realized that this was nothing but just a dream. D.A. <laughs>